What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna learn how to change the browser tab text that appears when we open some page on our WordPress website, okay? In a very simple, easy, effective and free method, okay? But before I can start, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us help the channel and because we bring daily videos about WordPress, SEO, site building, site design and many more topics in order so you can have an amazing online presence, okay? So let's go to the guide. Recently, one of our users did ask me about the browser tab content because the, his website was something like car washing and on the page he was seeing the title of the team that you are they were using okay and he could not change it but i'm gonna explain how to fix it in a very simple way okay and in another more customizable way okay so let's go to the point if you review the upper right upper left corner of my screen right here we have some some browser tabs okay so the very first one, it's called Visual Mentor, Elementor, Responsive, WordPress Team, okay? And this is the URL. Simple, right? But why? The page title is home. There's no, nothing right here. If I go to this page, Star Hating Widget, I can see Star Hating Widget, Visual Moto Sandbox. So this one seems to be very nice and working. However, the home is different and is different because the SEO title of this home page is Visual Mentor Elementor Responsive WordPress Team. Okay? So how to change this? This is exactly what we're gonna learn into this video. But let me show you another example. This page title is Borderless Widgets, Elements, Templates, and Toolkits for Elementor. So as you can see, the plugin title it's the browser tab title. Same for our Enzo WordPress team. The title of the page it's Enzo. So the title right here it's Enzo plus the website title. Okay, Enzo custom post type WordPress team. Website name WordPress.org. Let's go to Visual Modo. On Visual Modo homepage, as you can see, the browser tab title it's Visual Modo. Okay, and there is a subtitle that we did type it on the SEO title of the page, okay? So visual model, WordPress themes, plugins, templates, that works, okay? Simple, right? How to change this? And why we would need to change this? This is very important for lots of site users that, for example, purchase at some theme, purchase at some plugin, import at some pa previously made page using the one click, and would like to have this browser tab title changed. Let me show you the very first and more simple way to fix it, okay? We're gonna move to our WordPress dashboard, okay? So, where we need to change this? For home page, it's a very specific case because in any other page, it's used to have the browser, the, the browser tab title used to be the post or the page title, as I did show on the borders WordPress plugin, okay? But normally, if you go to the WordPress, left sidebar of menus and navigate to settings general right here you're gonna be able to find the site title and the site title gonna be the part of the browser tab title okay so let me show you right here in home page you're gonna learn how to fix later but let's go back to our let's go right here social icons widget can you see the title of the page is Social Icons Widget. So the browser tab have the title of the page and the title of the website. So browser tab widget plus visual model sandbox. That is the website title. If we change this website title right here to anything, for example, tutorial, the name right here gonna change as well. Gonna be Social Icons Widget plus oh, new name, okay? But what is happening with our home page and this is the whole point of the video this is the secret if your page have an seo title you most use some seo plugin 
in order to edit this title. In my case, I'm gonna be using the Yoast SEO WordPress plugin. It's completely free. We have a video explaining how to install and activate this plugin, okay? Here's the guy, okay? It's installed, it's completely free, okay? No need to purchase the pro version of the plugin, nothing like this, but let's go to our home page because to edit this we need to load the page editor specifically or the post editor specifically so you can click right here edit page or edit with elementor in the case that one depends edit page gonna be good for us we just want to edit the meta boxes of the seo so right here you're gonna scroll the page down and you can see the yoast seo tabs okay this is the point and here is our SEO title. This is the one appearing on our browser tab. So if I change this, for example, to visual modo, test, sandbox, website. This is gonna be our new browser tab title. Let me update the page. Now let's see the page design, the, the, the front end of the page. Can you see that the browser tab already changed? Now it's Visual Moro Test Sandbox Website. Can we edit it more? Of course. Visual Moro Test. We can apply some spacing, for example. So, visual motor test, space, sandbox website. As you can see, it's very simple. All the posts and pages or custom post types of your page, as soon as you activate any SEO WordPress plugin, gonna gain this part, SEO title, and you're gonna be able to edit your browser tab icon right here, your browser tab text right here. Can you insert variable? What are variables? For example, the tagline of the site, the site title, the separator, so in the case that I do not want to type sandbox, we're gonna type right here the page title that's gonna be test website. And instead of typing the content, I can apply the separator and the site title. Let me update the page and let us review the result. Can you see? We have the text that we did type it, that it was test website plus separator plus website title that's, that we did set on settings under dashboard general site title, okay? If we change the site title, of course, this text gonna change as well. This is a benefit of using the site title variable instead of typing the content but there are cases that for example let's imagine that this page content it's too big okay we have the title of the page that is too big a title of a blog post that is too big and in this case we can to not generate an seo issue we can delete the site title and the separator in order to have more space to type or content the title of our site okay this is just one example okay so you have no needs to play with it but it's good to know and a very useful option when you don't know how to change your browser tab title okay and that is i hope you guys enjoyed this video feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question in addition, in the case that you are in need of amazing widgets, elements, templates and toolkits for your website for free, go to our WordPress dashboard, okay? Go to plugins and navigate to add new. On add new, search for borders, install and activate. You're gonna be amazed of how many options we did create it for free. Moreover, in the case that you are in need of a free WordPress theme to empower your website, Go to Appearance, Themes, Add New, and search for our Enzo free WordPress team. This is the best free WordPress team that you can have. It has amazing features, okay, very, very advanced features for free. 
in addition and final finally in the case that you want your website done faster and with almost unlimited edition options support and extra benefits go to visualmoto.com.com and purchase our visual Moto pass product so you can choose from hundreds of pre-built websites that you can import with a single click or thousands of sections that you can import with a single click as well okay and count on our support on your site design and that is i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i see you tomorrow all the best